state of emergency is now in effect in 35 Florida counties declared by the governor. And as Lee mentioned, the storm could make landfall as a Cat 3 hurricane. And Avery Cotton joins us now with how that state is getting or how the state is getting ready and urging everyone to get prepared. Good morning. And we are already seeing a lot of folks prepare ahead of the storm as we wait to see what this storm could possibly do. In a news conference, Governor Rick Scott was stern and serious in his warning for people, especially those who live in the Panhandle and near Big Bend. Hurricane Michael is forecast to be the most destructive storm to hit the Florida Panhandle in decades. The storm will be life-threatening and extremely dangerous. We are already seeing the storm's effects in Cuba and eastern Mexico, where Hurricane Michael is bringing heavy rainfall. You can see here where waves are crashing along Cuba's coastline, and as folks watch the storm get closer, they are in preparation mode. Lines at gas stations have been long since early yesterday, and hardware stores are already starting to empty their shelves as people get plywood to board their homes and businesses. Some store managers say they sold out of generators early Monday when people started to learn more about the storm and its possible strength. Governor Rick Scott already activated members of the National Guard, declared an emergency in dozens of counties and asked the White House for a pre-landfall disaster declaration. Folks in the line of the direct hit admit they are taking this one seriously. I normally laugh these things off, but uh, this one I'm taking a little bit more serious because uh, it does look like it's going to do a direct hit the Panama City area. Florida State University and FAMU, which are both in Tallahassee, are closed today through the rest of the week because of the storm. Residence halls and dining services, though, will stay open. And we do have a list of local schools that are closed for the storm. You can find that on our website, WFLA.com. It's good to see people are taking this one seriously, though. Yeah, Absolutely. Better to be prepared, right? Yeah, we see what these hurricanes can do. Mm -hmm. All right.